Hi everyone, Muriel here. I have a card I wanted to come on and share with you guys. I made it this afternoon. I was in the mood of beginning some Mother's Day cards. So I was watching some videos and I got inspired by um, some cards that I saw. So I bought myself in the craft room and uh, decided on this five and a half by five and a half inch card. I use the last three pages of Simple Life. This is by Jen Hatfield, uh, homemade, very nice paper pad. I have used it up. I love giving my six by six pads one more chance and there were three uh, sheets left in this paper pad that I use. I didn't know how it was going to come together but I added a piece of cardstock and I put it on craft uh, mounted it on craft paper and I think it came out fine. So again it is five and a half by five and a half. I did lots of layering again. Um, I used this blue cardstock, kind of a bluish gray. Um, I mounted the music sheet paper. That's that sheet right there. And then I used the blue again and I used this pink uh, flowery which I don't see here but it definitely was in this pack so I'm not sure whether they um, shown them all but it was in there and then there was this black uh, printed sheet here that as I look at look at it it's upside down <laughs> that's really cool it's upside down but anyway uh, on top of that I did a put a white doily and then um, I'll show you I um, wanted to put in on this card I didn't want the Happy Mother's Day stamp I just wanted something different and this uh, paper pad allowed me to put one of these cut aparts these one by one inch cut aparts that says this one here says celebrate today and I think that's enough to be said because I'm going to share this with a friend so um, I have that mounted on some uh, uh, some of the same black and white uh, word paper and then on top of this blue and white butterfly and that is from Bow Bunny I don't know kind of when I got started I, I thought I would make a card using some of the chipboard pieces from this collection I picked this up at Ben Franklin which is a craft store here uh, is Bow Bunny chipboard and it has a lot of scrolls, a lot of tags, some butter, lots of butterflies and it's uh, from the Sweet Life collection and I don't think I have the paper pad but I use that navy blue edge and white butterfly and again just mounted the Celebrate Today on top. I did use these mini scallop scissors uh, to cut around the um, celebrate today to give it that postage stamp look and then I took um, I made these three uh, flags uh, banner strips and this is from the top of the tabs when you tear the paper out these pieces here so I just used three of those I cut them in half and then I made a um, ducktail at the end and I just um, hot glue them underneath the butterfly and the butterfly is mounted up on some dimensional stickers. I use some um, wanna scrap uh, bling. This is a uh, swirl, pearl swirl and I have it coming from underneath the butterfly out here and then I just cut individual pieces and put them in the three corners and then here I use some flowers. I pulled out um, some recollections and a few. I think this one is a prima flower. And then these two are recollections. And so they bring out the blue. The uh, burgundy one here brings out the pink from the uh, banner and the uh, where I did the layering. And then of course the gray. And then this is just a dye, a leaf dye that I have that I just cut out with some green paper that I recently picked up at a um, local craft store. So that was the front of the card and then I finished the inside and it looks really simple. There was one more sheet as I mentioned of black paper that I um, 
cut down I put some white on top the pink looks like this and I just use a, a scallop uh, punch and punched it out and then I'm using again one of those um, word squares this says for you and I have a little heart a little gold heart there and then I use one on the back and it says made with love so when you get these um, paper pads and many of them are starting to have sheets that look like this and it's just so many little square cut aparts and you know you can use them especially if they say stuff like hello there um, the thank you that one said made with love is perfect for the back of back of your card and then this also has um, had a page of these cut aparts that has these flower images hello enjoy so I've kind of just kept those with these um, to use Jane Jen Hatfield's uh, paper collections kind of crossover different um, collections so I may be able to use these one more time but that's my card share again I made it for a friend for Mother's Day I'm gonna make a few more Mother's Day cards um, for some friends as you know I lost my mom it'll be two years ago this Friday time has flown so um, I just want the cards to be uh, a celebration for um, some mothers that I you know work with and, and I see on a daily basis so that's my share for you guys today I hope you guys are doing well I am um, ready to horn it in we have been uh, to the uh, I had to go take my car to get the oil changed so we did that uh, we've washed clothes I've done her hair I'm going to do mine and then just kind of sit back and um, watch a little television and then we're going to call it a night so I did want to show you guys one more thing I was in my craft room looking around and saw what fell behind is one more pack or my last pack of these flower bundles that I was selling I made probably four sold three or made five sold four <coughs> but this one here is what's left there are some cream white mint green peach flowers there are some beautiful cherry blossoms um, some clothes type uh, rose buds um, some lavender there's here some really lavender tight tight small mini roses there are some leaves gold and white and then I have two fabric um, flowers here and then here are eight of my felt rolled flowers that I have made so if you're interested just leave me a comment down below this is a PayPal purchase it's $20 um, US only PayPal only uh, friends and family please so if you're interested let me know um, I will probably get it out in the mail to you tomorrow you just leave me a comment down in the uh, comment section and I certainly will send to you my uh, PayPal address so I thank you guys for watching for this uh, mother Mother's Day card that I made using the simple life from the Jen Hatfield paper paper um, pad. Thanks again. Bye now.